Hello, we are inside the, the MDM Team Lab and uh, we want to show you a demonstration of uh, Zeno LV while operating in uh, uh, joystick assisted mode. Uh, the difference between the regular joystick mode and the joystick assisted mode is that during uh, joystick assisted mode the vehicle uh, is actually in dynamic positioning over the six axis. So it's now controlling its position and its attitude with all the eight engines. Now we will show you how it's easy uh, is to move Zeno in the space. In particular we use uh, this uh, uh, cloche and uh, with this cloche you can move forward and backwards and you can move also sideways. Uh, for example, uh, if we move uh, backwards we just pull the lever and the vehicle will move and when we stop the vehicle will stop. Uh, we can do the same by moving sideways. Uh, so for example, this will move the vehicle sideways while keeping its setting and attitude and depth. Same thing we can do, of course, the other way around. Uh, so we can uh, move the vehicle, uh, <coughs> for example, to scan a uh, vehicle hull or a uh, harbor uh, port uh, structure uh, and so on. Uh, to change its orientation, we can use this uh, button here, which will uh, set a new heading for the vehicle. And by the time we stop, uh, the vehicle will keep its heading uh, and uh, position. Let me put the vehicle uh, back to the center of uh, the scene. So we can uh, show you more uh, interesting uh, motion of our vehicle. Let's put uh, Zeno again with the classic heading uh, settings. So let's put the Zeno looking forward to the swimming pool. And now let's try some uh, a little bit uh, different uh, kind of motion. One interesting fact about Zeno is that we control all the axes in dynamic position. So for example, we can perform a side scan motion while keeping a very unusual roll configuration. Let's do that. So with this lever here, we are now going to change the role of Zeno. And you can see from Zeno uh, its role configuration from, uh, from the camera. So now we have a different uh, role set up. We can try to move uh, sideways, for example, performing a, a completely unusual inspection by keeping this uh, uh, roll angle and this depth and position. If we leave the lever, Zeno will return to the 0, 0 roll and pitch settings and keeping the usual uh, heading configuration. Last uh, demonstration we want to show you here is actually the possibility of moving while keeping also pitch, uh, high pitch angle. So to do this, uh, let's uh, just rotate uh, 90 degrees uh, Zeno to show you the pitch angle. We just rotate Zeno uh, around this uh, position and uh, we stop, uh, so we keep Zeno in this uh, configuration for the heading. And now in order to change the pitch, it's very easy. We use this, the same lever we use for the roll, we use for the pitch. So in order to put the, the Zeno no, uh, nose up, we just lower this uh, lever. This will put Zeno in a roll, in a pitch configuration of 45 degrees. And, we will and it will stay in this position unless we change the settings. So now that it's in 45 degrees, we can move forward, for example, by, by using the usual lever, which moves Zeno in space. So now you can see Zeno is moving 45 degrees. And again, if we leave everything, Zeno will, will stop again in that position as usual. We can move Zeno back and uh, we, can, uh, we can do more maneuver in the next video and show you how, it's, how easy it is uh, to maneuver Zeno and uh, use uh, Zeno to perform uh, inspection of uh, underwater sites and uh, infrastructure. Uh, from uh, Vincenzo Calabro and the MDM team, it's uh, everything. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, please subscribe to our channel.